Greetings everyone, you are welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Simbol Z. I welcome you all. Following the last video I made, the promise I made that I was going to show you guys, especially those people that live in Onisha and also um, those people that have a lot to do along the Ore Road. I promise I was going to direct you guys to the route, the new route that I found um, stress-free no not stress-free but danger free okay I find it danger free it is very much better okay it's better than going through a way road with fear your BP will become so high after you must have gone through and through a way road because most of these um, trucks most of these um, trailers most of them are not even good a lot of them you see that the driver is just managing it okay managing it playing with people's life so i found out about this road i promised that i was going to show you guys so this is all about it so this video is all about that see here um i searched i searched my previous videos that i've made about this route but i just found out that i have no one that i did i made a video exactly from the beginning maybe from up Iweka, up Iweka to to down to oboko down to enamel or adazian okay so because of that i'm going to manage this video to tell you guys what i want to tell you but the next video I'm, I'm going to make, I'm going to try to make a complete video about this route and explain. Okay, maybe when I do the video, the video will explain it on its own. But I'm going to try and explain so that the people that know this place very well is going to make use of this route and will be happy that they do. It is danger free. Like it is... Um, let me say 90% danger free unlike a way road that is 150 danger 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 in view you can f see danger in a way road you can feel it you can you can almost handle it you just keep pleading for the blood of jesus to cover you and have mercy you just be confessing all your sins tell promising god you're not going to go back to your sin if he will just deliver you for this one one time it's over road is not a fun place like it's not a fun a fun route at all so now let me start so this place you are seeing now is a um, way road up worker okay so before you reach mtn office that you are seeing by the left across the road yeah by the um, direct right is ubuduku road okay as i said please pardon me i'm going to do a proper video about this all right and it's going to be urgent because a lot of people might will definitely like this all right so direct to direct opposite of mtn is obuduku road you just have to go down after feelings after police station the next junction you take left and go straight like straight before you know it you come out at a um, enamel it is a uh, it is um accessible now because of uh, the work our governor has started at Oboko. That is why sometimes when I make video and talk about uh, our governor and his work, I am directing it sometimes to people that are paid to do the work. Because definitely you cannot tell me that it's our governor that is doing that uh, road with, uh, with uh, just laziness. It's not our governor, definitely. It is the people that are paid to do that work. They are doing it as if they are doing it, uh, doing people a favor. They are not being paid but anyway the way that road has been cleared like the way it has been cleared make it so easy for you to assess it in this rainy season that is why i commended my my governor in the last video because of how the, the road are cleared some part of the roads are tied and some are not all right so it is very much good I won't say better than a way road because it's incomparable. It is very much good. If you are going to Enamel, 
because the reason why I am saying this and stressing this is that if you are going to enamel from a let me say from Opi Waker, I think this is going to be a safer route for you because that um enamel that road that those that I'm sorry for stuttering. Those places before enamel, like opposite, uh, is it the palace for choosing? Is a death trap. It is almost like the rose are the a deep gutter is being um, built a big dog in front in in the middle of the road. It is so dangerous and as dangerous as it is, you see trailers climbing in and out of it. All right, some will fall and some will not. I think they are doing trial, a big trial lock, if I will put it that way. If I die, I die. Those um, drivers of trailers, and sometimes I don't even know whether, I, I, can't, I can't even explain. In fact, let me just not diverge to another thing other than the video of safety that I want to make now. Please, um, if you follow this route, after that police station, and at Obuduku Road, then very next junction, you divert from the left, you will just go straight, like straight without cutting corners. You will see yourself at Enamel. That is some kind of a safest side of a railroad. But um, after Adazian, the other part of a railroad, road, after Adazian, the other part of a railroad is not that. Um, like on all that uh, bad is bad though yeah it's bad but it's not all that bad compared to those uh, that the road before the, those places before like before enamel okay it is not as bad those places before enamel are death trap so if you can if you can avoid it please avoid it if you are going on a charter please tell the person that is carrying you to avoid that route if you are going with your own car this is the best way you can get to enamel without stress all right because of the work the governor is doing though they are not speed in doing the work but it at least it has helped a lot like we don't have the story to tell like last year so but we are telling it now it's very much better all right so this is it i don't know if i am able to pass uh, this information well but uh certainly by the grace of god i'm going to make a proper video from the beginning to the end so that i will be able to save lives all right see you in the next one i also will encourage you to thumbs up the video if you find it interesting all right so that youtube will be able to push the video to a lot of for a lot of eyes to see and uh, people will see and um, they will make use of the advice that i've just given and lives are saved less people will be plying through that over road okay even if you are going to like you are traveling to away with your own car if you go through this place i i just said now it's going to be less it's going to be safer for you okay those places um i don't know the names of those places you see that uh, how do, do i even describe it before uh, before deeper life before choosing <laughs> those places are danger trap are death trap avoid it if you can see you in the next one bye